to it. Let's see if uh, Team Texas keeps their same team composition. It looks like they do. Uh, Man, I can't get over how great this mod is in neutral starts. Yeah. Uh, protagonist showing that he has less fear in his heart than Let's Go did. He is playing Fox and Team. Let's Go yeah. opted to play Pika. Protag said, no, I'm a real Fox fan. I'm playing Fox and Team. But Lou, he's, he's mm. Which will help a good I feel like Fox is a very good character in Teams. I don't know why I feel like people will play more often. It's kind of like the Fox syndrome with a lot of things. It's like, Fox is amazing in this matchup if he's playing perfect. The problem is, Fox gets hit and then he can just die. So we're gonna see. Okay, he made it back. You see, a lot of the stuff he's going for, a lot of these recoveries, they're too low. And he's going too close to the stage. A lot of Fox's, like, uh, good parts about his recovery is the fact that he has such a good amount of drift. Yeah. So it's, like, better to start your up B further away from your opponent and then drift in than to try to up B in. So you don't want to jump too close to stage and then start your up B, you want to jump further away. Which seems counterintuitive, but it works. <laughs> but it works. I was expecting an up smash, but I guess up tilt works, too. Up tilt works. Because he knows the percents. Or you're just hoping he'll kill. And then you get up tilt stale a little bit, so then it's comboing longer, and it's just, oh, uh, Kirby. Yeah, Fox is mm, gone. I was expecting Kirby to do a runoff, so do something. I don't think he can save Fox in that situation. You could have done inhale and then spit him out, or suck him in. Oh, yeah. That gives you your jump back. I could see up air, maybe. Nah, uh, it's too laggy, because the Kirby might end oh, up being yeah. inside. Anyways, Fox is got Puff at the leg. Fox notably does have a good matchup against Puff. Very good matchup. See, there you go. That's what I'm talking about. Starting further away and then up being um, Fox made it back. He's trying to take this KO. Nice. Good job throwing him out of the way, but too bad to lose him. He tried his best to cover his uh, teammate's recovery there, but he just went straight to that platform. His opponent was playing, so. Oh no, that's unfortunate. But really, they're not that far behind. CTG could yeah, die. but they were ahead. Yeah. So now that must be a little upsetting. Because that's when you start getting flustered. That's when you start doubting yourself and you start thinking, I could have won. I could have won. All these could have. Did you get rested? Yeah. Star KOs are really bad in this situation. Oh my god, this year. Stop doing that. Remember when you lost after doing that a million times? God. Oh yeah, he did, actually. <laughs> So lame. Don't taunt on people. It's just BM. It doesn't look good. No one likes it. It's not good for the game. Bad trade there for protagonists. His blue team goes down to both their last stocks. So yeah, you it. see how quickly this turned around? Yeah. Well, he lost one stock and all of a sudden they lost to four more. CTG just started Oh fighting my those god. Rests. Pounce? Fox made a Oh, Desheer just to run off up air. And then Jab, up smash, or kill Pikachu here. But oh, I thought he was going to try to arrest him with the invincibility. Another taunt from Red Team. Yeah. But this is what happened to them last set that we watched. They won game one pretty handily. Yep. Started taunting, starting to feel themselves, and then Team just like that, it all fell apart. I think it's because a lot of players like this, a lot of players of this caliber, you know Peach is like a broken character, but you don't know which kind of Peach you're going to be playing. Right. Because there's a lot of downer heavy Peaches, there's a lot of upper heavy Peaches, there's a lot of Wookiees, grab spammers. Yep. There's quite a lot of different Pikachus out there. So, the longer the set goes in on, the more custom you get to which kind of rat you're playing. So, Desheer seems to be a more of an edge guarding rat. Not the best, but he is one for sure. He uses grab in almost every situation possible, rather than any other move. He uses a lot of Nair and Bear. And F Smash, of course. He F Smashes that ledge every single time, if you notice. There hasn't been like one edge guard situation where he didn't F Smash. <laughs> And when he didn't F smash, he always messed it up. That's how you can tell he doesn't practice this rat often. He's just using his, he's purely using fundamentals and no care yeah. knowledge. It doesn't have to be your Pikachu doesn't have to be as clean as like doubles. You don't still have to be pretty clean against this team. Blue Sam and uh, Protag are not are not like a team to scoff at. It's definitely a team you have to take seriously. This is when I think Fox really shines. His ability to 1v2 characters is amazing. How many times have we seen LG come back from like 1v2 situations? I feel like there was like a few weeks in 2015 where that was like every single Xanadu. Like he would like be against 1v2 and clutch it out. Yeah. Fox has really good aerials for walling people out. That was a nice recovery right there. 
Green is really good too. Oh no, he messed up. He messed up his up smash. Yeah, I think he actually showed up up here. Oh my god! Stop it! Who likes it? Blue team with the lead again, starting off the game strong, but can they hold it? Yeah, yeah. good by protagonist coming to save his partner, helping him with recovery. Yeah, exactly. Sometimes you just gotta give up on attacking a certain opponent, and just help out your friend, or help out your friend kill yeah. the opponent. And Puff is not gonna catch you if you run away from her. Exactly. Puff's not gonna catch especially as Fox. Fox is a very fast hit. Mm, yeah, good job rolling out there. I can tell if you want to come in with like a fair and up air. Alright, gets back there. It's gonna be death. Oh, why'd you back? Okay, I, he's alive, thankfully, but of all things, why back throw, not forward throw? See, I that's how you see logic was. I don't want to throw my teammate into the opponents, but then he didn't realize that he was at a high percent either, so he's like, I'm just gonna back throw real quick. Like, oh, wait, he might die. Okay. I feel like just because he stands back throw. Maybe. Like, I feel like the only time he does F throw is when he's spamming R, so he accidentally does a throw immediately. Drill jab up smash. The classic. The classic. Alright. Uh, I feel like he should have been up. Oh my! What the heck? Uh, yeah, definitely. That was not, nuts. Not the right idea there. That was weird though. I don't know what's gonna happen. The stocks are even. Both red team off stage. I feel like Lucian has to be getting a lot more miles off Protax grabs because Fox up there back there set up pretty well for a lot of situations where Kirby can get like a good version. Especially Darren. Oh no! See, she and gets snatched! He's gonna share his stock, he is. That feels bad. Ow. Oh no. Okay, Kirby still Can Lucian and Protax clutch this out? Maybe bring it back. Oh, start you up now. No, I just started that late. Start now. Like, see, this is what I'm talking about. He keeps starting it late. So he's not gonna. He's not able to drift back. Because it's not the travel time during the upbeat that gets Fox's distance. It's the drift itself. So, travel time helps, but he gets a lot of drift after being an upbeat. Oh my god, why? He's dead. Okay, there we go. Finally. Thank you. Red team gonna find that? I think they're gonna go dropping games for this year now.